Here we are. See up there. Another one on the railway. to the end, five miles, and then they turn the carts. Just like that. Then they push them back here, and then they're ready to go again. So 10 mile trip. And that is where we dead ended. Young's High Bridge. Up there, that's Wild Turkey Distillery. In case you didn't know, now you know. That's over the Kentucky River right now. Now we're at the top, waiting to go back. Or the bottom, whatever. We're at the end, waiting to go back. Five miles back now. And on the way back, we're in the front. It's a slightly different view. Going back into the train depot, 10 miles. Pretty cool, they got a bunch of different trains out here. Only on Saturdays though, okay. All right, how was your ride, T? It was good. It was a lot of fun. Very pretty scenery. Good. That was wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so to fill you guys in on the rail explorers, uh, basically there's a few of them around the country. Kentucky, Pennsylvania, New York, out west. And what you do is you have to register ahead of time. You won't be able just to walk in there um, and be like, I would like to get on an adventure today because uh, all the cars were full when we went and everybody had registered ahead and this was on a Monday morning. Okay, so you need to think about this beforehand. Now, if by chance you're passing one and you're gonna, you don't have anything to do that day, they'll probably be able to get you on like a later excursion. Uh, so you can go in there, you pay for a later excursion and you should be fine. Uh, basically, it's the pedal cars. You saw in the video, uh, there's two seaters and four seaters uh, on the one we went to and you ride all the way down. They, they space you out pretty good um, to give you your privacy and you can go at your own pace and leisure and you'll see stuff along the way, a lot of nature and you kind of get, so when we did the one in Kentucky, so you saw horse farms, you passed a bunch of horse farms, you got to see that kind of up close instead of driving by on the road or if you're doing a tour sometimes you don't get to see you know the stuff that's in the back of the farm this is the back of the farm okay it's right next to the uh, railroad so you got that and then you have some old um like railroad cars if it's a, a two-sided thing so you you're going past all this you're going to see it um so railexplorers.net is the website you could do daily rides sunset tours lantern rides they have a night one where you could do it at night this would be great for groups youth group uh like a, a group of adults that are just want to go out there um, the only one person has to be sober on the car the person that's controlling the brakes and um yeah that's that's pretty much it uh you go down it was ours was a 10 mile trip so you go down five miles it stops it turns you around and you come back um, at the dead end is like an area where you can get off you're not supposed to get off while you're riding you're supposed to just keep riding you can slow down if you want speed up whatever but when you get to the dead end and they're turning your car around uh, which you saw in the video how they do it like a, a, a basically a pneumatic jack that comes up and then they spin it and then 
it's ready for you for whenever you're ready to go back. Um, but you can hang out at the dead end. You know, like I said, if you bring a cooler with some drinks, you can drink your drinks there. Um, and uh, awesome views throughout the whole thing. So very, very cool. You should definitely go check it out uh, wherever you want. We will definitely be doing it again. We'll definitely find it the next place that we're going to go. Or if we're traveling to a new place, we'll definitely see if this is available because um, it's really cool. It's, a, it's like a once in a lifetime opportunity to do. It's not hard. Um, so it's, the pedaling is not hard. It's, it's very low gear. Okay. You're not expending a lot of energy. You're not going to be sweating or anything like that. Um, and it, it was really cool. You get to do something different. So go check them out and go try something different and go do it. Uh, but that's the backstory of what this is. And also awesome gift shop there while you're there. And while you're waiting, they have stuff for you to do. It's not like that you just like, okay, here's my ticket to watch a movie. No, there's a lot of stuff for you to do there. This one actually had a railroad museum, which was closed the day we went, so we went on the Monday, but they did have a museum that you could go and, and do that stuff beforehand if you went on a day that it was open. Um, restrooms are available in, as well. So, And everybody was really super cool and nice, and they suggested an, um, a awesome restaurant, which we ate at, which you'll have to watch. It'll be in my shorts because it was a uh, diners, drivers, and dives video that uh, Guy Fieri went and visited. Um, so I was I looked super excited about that. Uh, but there, there you go. Like, subscribe, share this video, share the channel. That's how the channel grows. We're trying to get to 10,000 subscribers. If you look behind me, you'll see a, um, on the table, you'll see some stuff I'm going to uh, do reviews of next if that's something you're interested in. And uh, thank you and God bless.